is nothing too hard for you to accomplish or achieve as long as you're willing to be consistent. And why would you not be willing to be consistent for your life? If you don't show up for your life, who else will? I tell you, opportunity is never given, you create it. What opportunities are you missing out on because you're not willing to show up and boldly stand in your gifts uniquely? You gotta be willing as young ladies to boldly show up and be authentically who you are. Stop trying to be who everybody else wants you to be and just be who you desire to be. It's not somebody else because if you try and be somebody else, you'll never be great at it. Because there's only one you, and so you can't be a copycat of somebody else. Because where they are destined to end, what if you were destined to be further? I told you, each and every one of you, we are women and we are designed to run the world. You don't need anybody else to tell you you're amazing, you're great. Tell yourself every day you're amazing and you're great. Because then when they forget to tell you, it won't hurt you because you know to celebrate your own self. So as young women, you gotta start telling yourself every day when you get up, I'm amazing. I am beautiful. I am unbreakable. I am unapologetically great in who I am. So some of you gotta be willing to stand out. How many of you have ever heard of eagles? You know the birds, eagles? Do they fly and pack like regular birds? They don't do that. They fly alone, don't they? Why? They what? They're independent. What else? They're mighty. Anybody else? In the back, young lady. They're powerful. Yes, I love that answer. She said they're big, so they might hit another one. That means, hey, that just means your gifts are so big, you need a little bit of space. They're bold. Yes, bold enough to say. They're bold enough to fly higher so that you can see them. You have one. Leaders. Yes. They're aggressive. They soar, yes, that was it. So here's the deal, ladies. Each and every one of you, how many of you want to fit in? Because some of you raised your hand. And it's okay, here's where you be honest so you can get something different. Can I tell you, when you're only focused on fitting in, you miss out on where you're really supposed to be. Some of you are missing truly who you are because you want to be who everybody else is and who everybody else wants you to be. Stop trying to be the Nicki Minaj's and the Cardi B's. They, they, they good, but guess what? That ain't your journey. Stay in your journey and ride out your journey. Start creating things that nobody even thought existed, but you knew it and you created it. You're an innovator. You're a leader. Leaders gotta first be willing to serve, but most importantly, leaders are not a follower of the wrong path. Leaders are the ones who will lead the path. But when you lead, make sure you're looking back and helping somebody else. Don't ever go just wanting to be a leader, but you don't want to help somebody. That's not a true leader. And a leader is not a dictator, wanting to dictate everything that's going on, but a leader leads by example. And everybody else will be wanting to follow you because you have something for them to learn from. Ladies, you are not designed to fit in. You are designed to stand out. Take hold of your power. Take it back from whoever you gave it to on the playground, in your school, in your class, wherever it might have been, take it back and own it from this day forward because eagles don't fly in packs, they soar above everybody else. Take up your wings and start soaring because as women, we run the world. I am Regina Robinson, international speaker, author, coach, and champion for young girls. I travel the world inspiring young women to believe in themselves, to trust themselves, to love themselves, and most importantly, to show up and be unapologetic for who they are, who they are becoming, and who they are destined to be as they become women. To every young woman under the sound of my voice, get ready, get ready, get ready. The best is yet to come. You have only scratched the surface in your life. 